What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to part two of the Northwest Open, being played at Oceans of Memories Golf Club. Uh, currently, we're at five under after day one, and we're not in first place. Lee Westwood had a nice six under round that first round. This uh, course had some putting woes on it. I'm going to see if I can't figure out what's going on here today. Well, this lovely October 17th eve, well, afternoon, I think I usually upload these at around 3 o'clock or so. Either way, let's go ahead and get straight into round two of this major event. Thank for the gold tease. Position two. John and Luke, what you got? Hello and welcome to the Northwest Open. Well, at the business end of the tournament, final round action coming your way. I'm Luke Elvey. With me is John McCarthy. Hello, Luke. Glad to be here. Hi to the folks at home. Uh, Luke, if you could tell me out of the gate, what are we looking at here as far as a score to beat? John, the leader, currently sits at nine under par. Thanks, Luke. Looking forward to comparing notes later on. So, all right. Nine under is uh, where the leader is sitting now. We're at five, I believe, for the tournament. Let's see if we can hit a drive that ends up around here. He had a great round yesterday, and uh, I'm expecting Perfect. some of the same today. Nice Hope you're shot. right. I think you'll like that. And about 130 yards to the pin. Uphill, 8 miles an hour in the face. I'm just going to play it as is. Looking good. Yeah. <clears throat> That's what you want. This putt's about a two-footer. That's how you want to start off day two of your major. And that one will drop for birdie. Looking all spiffy out there. And starting <clears throat> around with a birdie. I do want to apologize if some of the uh, coloring doesn't and match. Setting up for this par five. Yeah, some of the coloring doesn't match on my guy. That's because uh, I am colorblind. I, I did my best, I promise. But sometimes it's tough for me to tell exactly what colors I'm using. Please be in the fairway. God bless eating my lunch is par fives. I'm not capitalizing on them. I haven't the entire tournament. Sit it over here. <clears throat> Should get me to Perfect roughly lob wedge pitch. Bunker. Back on the fairway. Let's see how far the flop is. Nah, we're, we're flopping this 100%. So much better than a pitch. I feel like I would have carried into the bunker. Is for birdie. Little right, little back left. I think the back left is a little harder than the right. Oh my gosh, it didn't go right at all. Ooh, and it just, it just stayed straight. And this one's about four feet from the cup. It is fine. Just tap it in, move and on. That putt will drop. Struggled on par fives all week. And after that whole one under for the day. I say all week as if I'm playing the entire thing. And team off on this next hole. The wind could come into play. We'll glad, glad the wind's still in the face. That kind of allows me to just go right forward. I'm going to aim a little left today. Let's hile off this one way up there. Oh, she is a beaut. And that was spectacular work. Ooh. Hitting the green on this par four. Come on. The tee. Don't mess it up. Got it. Nice and eagle. Drops for eagle. And he's moving in the right direction, moving up on the leaderboard after that hole. Ties me for first now. Lee Westwood, he's already through 12 holes, but that eagle helps out a lot. And teeing off on this par three. Last time we hit a high lofted shot. This time I'm just going to hit it as is. And going with the nine iron. This one's looking good. Yep, good call. This one's about nine feet away. Got a lot of break in this short little putt. Just going to hit it easy and lag her up there. If it goes in, it does. If not, oh, let's get the par. Oh, my That was very close. This one's about two feet from the cup. Jeez. 
That putt will drop for putt. I'm struggling keeping it in the zone, I feel like. And after that, Holdy will move down and into second Ooh, place. Westwood grabbed a bird. Okay, let's see what the fifth has in store today. He's not going away without a fight. That's for sure. Yikes, that fast movement. Getting the fairway still. That's lucky. I think he's going to like that. Yeah, about a buck ten to the pin from here. I think I do this. Downhill, downwind a lot. Get there. Thank you. I at least got to the green. And this one's for birdie. Right, right off the get-go. It's just going to stay left. Ooh, that that would have been good. What was... And tapping in. Like, <laughs> I just forgot how to use and my hand there. One, he's going to stay right where he was on the leaderboard. And moving on to the sixth. Feeling good now. Tell me how much longer we can go stronger every day. Do -do 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 -do. Immense no one can power tell me on that I course. do me wrong. Some, what is that, Chicago? Or not and Chicago. 115 yards to the pin. Let's play this gap wedge as is. This one's looking pretty good. Boom! All right, and he's on. Got about five feet to go here. That's what we'd like to see. See if we can't get back in a tie for first. Boom. And that one goes for birdie. A boom, ba boom, ba 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 boom, boom. And the ba 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 boom, ba boom, ba boom, ba boom, boom. If anyone can name that movie, that one's a obscure reference. Hole has in store today. I mean, all I did was go ba 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 boom, ba boom, ba boom, boom, boom. Based on medieval times, if you can think about it. And some serious power involved in uh, a drive like this. Mm-hmm. I want me to do a pitch shot? No, no, no. Pitch shots have failed me here lately. Let's just go with a normal shot. Let's high loft it up a little. Let the wind carry it to it. Might Bring it back. Too much come club. on, come on. Keep coming, keep coming. That's fine. All right, he's on the green now. And this putt is for birdie. Okay. Give her enough break. Tap her on down there. And she's still going to break too Ooh, much. Inches, inches wow. away. Wow, and how far is that running? Five feet to go here. Oh, I thought and I missed the it. Par putt will drop. Hanging true. For that one, he's still tied for first. Hanging true. And give, setting up for the par three hole. Give you a score update after nine. Okay, up three feet. I'm just gonna play it, or 43 feet. I'm just gonna play it as is. It looks like a six iron. Well, this is definitely. Come on back down. That's gonna be such a tough putt. And I can't believe it went that is far. Or birdie. That just feels impossible to play enough break at any point. It's all right. Still walking away with par. And currently sitting at four under for the day. Lee Westwood is almost done with his day. We do have a couple people to worry about. Jared Lyle, he's at seven under through nine holes. And on to the ninth hole. Well, this one's looking like it's in the fairway. 290 with wind in the face. Not For bad. 130 yards. I want me to take that. No, no, no. I'm definitely stepping up to a wedge. Gonna, I'll high loft it up a little. Here's Come on, stay, wedge. stay on the green. This could be good. It's heading for the green. That's here. good. And Below the hole. 19 feet to the cup. A little bit of a left break but I can be slightly more aggressive with this one than I have been with some of the others. 
That wasn't aggressive at all. That's what we call Hands wimpy. The par. Got the par, though. And That's that fine. Drops. And as he finishes up here on the front nine, Luke, he's found himself in a pretty favorable spot. Tied for the lead is a great position heading into the final nine holes, but this is when the tournament really heats up. A lot of golf left to play. Thanks for that, Luke. So as you can see, we are tied for the lead. Lee Westwood is done with his day, though. No more holes for him. Jared Lyle, though, he's making a push. He's just eight under through ten holes. He's got eight more holes left. I have nine. Chichi Rodriguez, Sandy Lyle there at seven under. Then we drop down to five with Barnes, Fowler, Nalen, and Hatton. And Tiger Woods, hey, he's making a push at four under. And now teeing off on the par five. All right, I refuse to believe I can keep hitting bad tee shots on par fives. I'm going to aim over here. I'm going to hit a draw. Decent sized draw, too. Let's back off a little bit. Just a magnificent Oh my gosh, power. I guess I can keep it up. I just, oh, no way, no way. Not going to mess with it. Going this way. And that that was trouble waiting to happen. Hey, for once I actually have like a good yardage. We'll say that was planned. Oh yeah, there we go. And, uh, I'm gonna get a birdie. Like that. And this putts for birdie. Finally birdie now in the par let's five. Take a look at the leaderboard. And he's still in first place after that hole. Yeah, but I take solo possession of it now. But Jared Lyle, man, he's making a push. Guy ain't missing and right moving now. On to the eleventh hole. 145 downhill. I'm definitely backing off the club. I'm going to high loft it up a little. Just let this one go in the hole. With the pitching wedge here. And this one's heading towards the green. Good shot. And he's on the green. Looking like eight feet to the cup here. Is there a break? A little right, a little left. Just hit it straight. Boom. And that one drops for the birdie. That's what we like to see. And six under par on the day after that hole. And there we go. teeing off on this par four. Starting to come alive. Let me back off a club. I'm doing well hitting all my greens in regulation, and I want to keep it up. And this is looking fairway bound. This is a long hole, but... From here, about 2.30 to the pin. Luckily, flags all the way in the back. Just get it up to it. And get there. That's the hybrid. And this one's looking yeah. pretty good. There we and go. That one is on the green with quite a bit of real estate to make up. This is a good shot. I think I got it. Boom. And that one will go for birdie. All right. And as we check the standings, he's still in first after that one. Gosh, I'm starting to run away with right, this now. Let's see what uh, happens on the 13th that's hole. What we like, that's what we like to see here in a major event. Okay, I messed up my drive on this hole last time. Don't think I did it today. Yeah, yeah that's good. Looking shot here. Oh, yeah, she's good. And about 2.35 to the pin from here. Yeah, let's just hit the hybrid. You know what? I'm going to high loft this because it seems like high loft just go forever. That looks like the hybrid. This one came up a little short, but that's fine. Should be able to get on the green from there. Ooh. Oh, how's that, that not stay in? in on that chip. And they're about three feet away here. Another birdie. birdie. That's what we like to see. I'm telling you, you hit greens, and it works out well for you. Currently sitting at eight under. <laughs> all right, all right, and all right. Next up is a par four, folks. Par four. Working with just hit her up the middle. Yes. Oh, this one's looking pretty good. Oh, it's because it's smashed. 333 yards. 
And from 150 yards out. I'm definitely backing off the club. I'm going to let it run up to it. Downhill, downwind. This one's looking good, folks. Yeah, that's fine. And this one is on the green with a lengthy putt ahead. Oof. Play enough break. Lag her up there. Take your pot. Oh, and wouldn't that have been nice? It's on a nice streak there, but no need to mess and it up. Little drop for par. And after that one, he's still managing to hold on to first place. Holding strong and on to first place. For the par four tee off. Let's take a look at the scores after this tee or after this hole. And that was a powerful, powerful drive. Yeah, it ends up in the rough, but that's fine. Glad I stepped up a club. This one's about three feet away. And boom, another birdie. And that putt will drop for birdie. Hitting all the green so far. No change for him, leaderboard wise, after that hole. Oh, and forgot to take a peek at the scoreboard. That's fine. The 16th tee. Wind smack in the face. Just gonna aim right there, but hit some fade. Maybe even a little bit more. It's looking like it's heading into the fairway. Yep. Good shot. Nope, definitely not going out the hole. Let's just go there, over these trees. Okay, should have maybe like what, a lob wedge in? Want me to pitch this? Just because I've hit like every green so far, I'm aiming much more right than I need to. Going with the nine iron and heading for the green. I didn't feel and like. And pretty sure he's going to like that. I didn't feel like this some crap happening. Prepared. I can still make this 18 footer up the hill. I didn't, but I could. <laughs> just right. Yes, about three feet to the cup from here. All right. Jammer in the back of the hole. And no change ranking wise after that hole. So you can see pretty much everyone's finishing up their day right here. I'm at 14 under, barring something crazy okay, happening. I think I might have this one in the back. Way downwind with this one. I did this last time and just high lofted it ever so slightly, and it did stay on that front portion. So well, let's see if it does like it again. A, uh, five iron. Yeah, this one is going to run down to where I wanted it to last time. That's so perfect. This putt's for birdie. Come on back. Gosh, I should have just putted it. And this putt's for par. They changed the distance you hit the stuff. It's a good putt, oh this good stroke, good and it's in. True. Good save. And that putt drops on in for par. And he's going to stay right there where he was on the leaderboard. No change in the ranking. All right, let's and just hit this last the green. Hole. Hit this last green in reg, and should be a good day. And fantastic distance on this drive. About 160 yards to the pin here. Please. And here's an eight iron. This one's heading for the Stay green. Stay on the green. All right. Did it. Did it. Did it. At least I'm pretty sure. I don't think I missed a green. But I can recall. A 62 on their final round. Don't really care if it goes in. Let's just lag it up there. Had it if I'd hit it. This one's about two feet from the cup. 63. Here I come. And that par putt will drop. And he's done it, Luke. He proved himself today. And he has played well enough to uh, become the winner of this event. 
Oh, you can see the elation on his face. What a performance. He deserved the victory right from the get-go. But this will do a lot for his confidence. I look for him to have a huge season from here on in. Well, on behalf of John McCarthy, I'm Luke Elvey. Hope you enjoyed today's coverage. Well, boom. There you have it. Finished at 14 under, and I won the event. Had a very solid 9 under. Lee Westwood and Jared Lyle both tie for second. Chichi Rodriguez and Sandy Lyle, they are to tie for fourth. Tyrell Hatton, solo sixth. Had a few players tied at seventh. Chris Nalen, Jim Barnes, Ricky Fowler at 500, and Thomas Bjorn. He snuck his way onto the board, shooting 200, 200 each day to finish at four under. Let's go ahead and advance. Getting close to level 12, not bad. I think I lack about one more round from getting level 12. Should have beat my... Yep, beat him in every category. Boom. There you go, Douglas Cadwallader. Get taken down, son. Let's see if I get a new rival. Ooh, Lee Westwood. See, that one's going to be a tough rival right there. Lee Westwood has been playing well. He came in second in this event, so this one should be fun against Lee Westwood. Boom. Rate this course. Still give it the four stars. Let's advance on. Did I not? I must have not done it. Oh, I did. Okay. I was about to say, I thought I, I thought I hit every green regulation. Boom. Advance into sponsor goals level three of this one. Let's go ahead and check this out before we get into the next one. Okay, so I need to win a PGA Tour event which has two or more rounds where every round is below par. Score eagle or better, and I need to win two majors. Uh, so I'll get this one next major, which is coming up very soon. And I will hopefully just make an eagle at some point. And I got two more majors that are pretty soon. Uh, where are we at right now? We just played the Northwest Open. So we have the Royal Championship. That is a major event as well, which is going to be a two-round. Uh, let me go quickly change this back to one. Uh, but the Royal Championship will be a two-round event. And also will the Golf Club Championship. Those are going to be the two majors. Just keep... I'll keep that uh, sponsorship on through the next round, and hopefully I can just go ahead and make a um, an eagle on that round. And hey, look, a rival down there, Lee Westwood, two under, going to be for our next event, which is the John Deere Classic, a TPC Deer run. Anyways, thanks everyone for watching. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.